Hello everyone, this is Roxas1359, and welcome to my newest Let's Play of Fable 2. Fable 2 was created and developed by Lionhead Studios, published in 2008 by Microsoft Game Studios for the Xbox 360. In 2015, this game was made available as one of the games you can play on an Xbox One through the Xbox One's backwards compatibility. So, Fable 2. You're probably asking a couple of questions such as, why am I starting with Fable 2? Why am I not doing Fable 1? Why am I doing Fable 2? Maybe another question that you are probably asking. And three, what's my history with the series? So the reason why I'm starting with Fable 2 instead of Fable 1 is because unfortunately I do not have a way to play Fable 1, nor do I really have the means of recording it very well. I do not have an original Xbox, I'm afraid. So, yeah. And while the 360 can play original Xbox games, the backwards compatibility is not that good. So that explains why I'm doing, you know, Fable 2 first. Second, why am I doing Fable 2? That is a very good question, one that hopefully this playthrough will actually give me an answer to, because honestly, this game isn't bad, but it isn't great. It's very average, to say the least, which I don't know. I think it might be nostalgia, because in the past, I used to play Fable 2 with my friends Lynx Paradox, the Afro Battler, and another friend of ours named Sean. We used to play this all the time, because back then, really, Xbox Live was the only means of online gaming we had, and this is one of the better things that had come out on Xbox Live for 2008. And so that's why we ended up playing Fable 2. But anyway, what is this project going to entail? This isn't going to be a 100% run. I can't guarantee I will get everything in the game because this game is very large and expensive. So I need to get my bearings. There are a few things I'm going to do. I'm going to try my best to do as many side quests as possible. And I'm going to try my best to get as many hidden collectibles as possible. In terms of DLC, in which this game had received two DLC options, I will be doing the Not Whole Island DLC quest line. But I will not be doing the See the Future quest line as I do not have see the future on my Xbox 360 nor do I really want to spend more money on this game than I really need to I ended up buying not whole island in the past back when it was on sale back when Microsoft used to use points for their Xbox live system but anyway guys I'm gonna end it off right here this has been Roxas1359 and I welcome you all to let's play fable 2 just as a heads up, these episodes are going to be a little bit longer than normal, so hope you can bear with me. See you guys next time.